So hey guys, so today we collab with a YouTuber. Um, he's called Plexer. So as I told you in the discussion of my video, uh, YouTube channel, we were going to collab with a YouTuber. So he is called Plexer, and he has the same amount of subscriber as me. So you could go ahead and check out his channel. And today is the episode one of pack making tutorial. We are also gonna be teaching him uh, along the way. So let's get all right. So we are. All right, so we are now here, and I was kind of making, I was kind of editing my um like the 16x pack. So today I'm gonna tell you how to make a texture pack. So let's get started, and I'm also gonna be teaching Nathik. So how are you, Nathik? And I'm done now. Will you share your screen? Yes, uh, yeah, sure. I will get lag. I think. You, uh, you will actually see my stream but with lag because like I'm already recording okay so we're gonna get into the tutorial pack so now first of all what you need to do is actually to get um a base packs uh, pack so you could like get any pack like the volleyball pack and or uh, stuff any pack you could just get any pack um, I'm also gonna be putting in my Discord. Join my Discord, and um, I'm gonna be putting that in my Discord. Uh, the base pack. So this is the tutorial pack. Now we're gonna go to assets Minecraft, and then we are gonna go to textures. Okay. So now what we are gonna do is everybody starts off with the diamond sword. So I'm also gonna go with the diamond sword. You know, go to paint.net. Zoom in. Yeah, guys. Now, now we have start. Now we have started teaching me. <laughs> so um, there is gonna be some stream lag. So um, control and Nathik and you also do along. Uh, you also open up your paint.net and do along with me. So that. Wait, I'm, I'm just gonna do three ones. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do is for now I'm gonna control a delete. And now we are gonna make a shape. So first of all, we are gonna make the like handle. So we are gonna just do like this, and then we are gonna go three pixels up, one pixel, one pixel, two pixel like this. I'm gonna go one more, and then like this, and then do the same at the other side. And now we are gonna do like this. So we have got the handle right at here. Uh, this is the handle. This is the uh, paramel, and uh, I don't know what is this called. I just forgot. And this is gonna be the blade. So I'm gonna make a shape for the blade. So this. So we have made the blade now. Or there is another uh, uh, type of handle. So I'm gonna show you that also. So the next type of handle is kind of like this. And then we just go like this, this, go like this, and then we go like this. So this is the default Minecraft handle, and now we are gonna go with another type of blade. So we are gonna go three pixel like this, and then make something like this. And we are gonna go down. So this is the second type. So we are gonna be using this for now. So now we are gonna make a palette. We are gonna do Control N. I'm gonna put two right here. I'm gonna do one. Okay. I'm gonna zoom in because this is very small. Now I'm gonna go cyan and one more cyan. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose the rectangle select. And now I'm gonna go to the hue saturation. And then I'm gonna make it dark. So I've got a palette here. Okay. Now what we are gonna do is we are gonna be in the primary. Now we are gonna choose the color picker. We are gonna do this. We are gonna choose this. Now we're gonna do like this. So we have choose the palette colors, and now let's shade on the blade. Okay. So now what we are gonna do is we are gonna do magic wand inside it. And I'm gonna do control magic wand and choose the outer parts also, um, just to make it a bit easier because it's the way I would do it. Now you could go in any ways. You could go like this, 
You could go like this, like this, and like this. Means like you could go from left to right, right to left, up to down, down to up. So I'm gonna go like this. Okay. Now you're gonna do the rectangle select and choose the outer outlines, or you could just get the um, the plugins. Uh, it's called the bold baits outline selection, but I don't I don't want to use that. So I'm gonna just select outside, and now I, uh, I'm gonna make it dark. So it's already darkened. Uh, I just made it in the background. Okay. So we're gonna click OK. So now we have a blade. Right? Hey. So this kind of looks okay, but we're gonna go a bit more stuff. We're gonna add a bit more details by. Um, oh, oh, oh. I, I, I just did something wrong. Um, we are gonna go right at here and um, make it a bit lighter and stuff. Saturation and make it light. Now, what I'm gonna do is, I'm also gonna select this, I'm also gonna make this also a bit lighter. Saturation and this one less lighter. Now we have our song, so this looks perfect. Now we yeah. have to choose. Um, a grey um, we are gonna make it a bit lighter because this is pretty dark and now we are gonna choose the secondary as black now we are gonna again choose magic wand choose these parts and by the way I didn't want the handle to be like this <laughs> my mistake -ly. um but the blade I wanted to be like that only we are gonna leave it for now and now what we are gonna do is we are just gonna like um, do a gradient so now we are gonna do this from down to up because that looks good now we are gonna do the rectangle oh my God, rectangle select like that and by the way I forgot to tell you this video is inspired by Finlay and Julia Right. Oops, that was a mistake. We are gonna go to use saturation and make it a bit darker. Make the outline a bit darker. And boom, we have our blade. And now what we are gonna do is we are gonna choose the secondary as this and primary as this. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna rectangle select these parts. Okay, so now what we are gonna go, uh, do is select these parts. No, no. Uh, select these parts, and now we are gonna go to the hue saturation, and it has been already okay. Now we are gonna go to our palette back, so that's why we use palette so that it becomes easier to like kind of get the colors back which we used in. So now what we are going to do is rectangle select this and gradient. Now what we are going to do is rectangle select the outer parts, do saturation and there we go we have the our song. Actually it looks That's good right? Very yeah. nice. Yeah. yeah. Also gonna be changing my blade because like the the other one blade which I made um, from now I really don't like it so I'm also gonna be changing the blade on my main back um, but not the handle all right so I'm also gonna show you in game so yeah guys I'm gonna real quick go in game and then show you this is the one sorry guys I, I, I literally found out this shape and then I found out that like something was wrong <laughs> alright guys so as you could see the sword looks pretty good 
and even though it's, it's a short sword so it is kind of good for, for the things um, like for pvp and stuff ps yes, boosting like, too yeah i think um texture packs usually don't boost my fps <laughs> because like I yeah but like, yeah but uh, the more like the more lesser the pixels are the more yeah, fps yeah, you get yeah absolutely i don't know if that boosts my fps but um, as you could see it looks pretty nice and now we could get into some next stuff uh, so yeah guys this getting to some other stuff Right, so now we are gonna edit the diamond. So what uh, what you must do is you must go into the same things textures. You must go into the model armor diamond layer one. I have already opened diamond layer two. And um, right there, we are gonna zoom in. And I think I shouldn't have closed my palette actually. Um, but it's okay. I'm gonna make it darker. So what you gotta do is it's simple. So what you are, what you are actually gonna do is you are gonna wait. Now the camera. So we are gonna start off with this. With the helmet. I'm gonna do with the helmet. Um, and if you want to like select more pixels in the rectangle select, you are gonna actually do the same. You are actually gonna click on continue and stuff. So like that. Or I think we should do the outline first. I think we should do the outline first. Okay. So we are gonna go with the outline. <laughs> Save it real quick, and guys, now let's see it in game. Yeah, let's see. All right, guys. So now I'm back, and as you can see, now the armor looks pretty cool, as you can see only. So, um, yeah, guys. So, like, as you could see, this armor looks pretty cool. Sword also, so guys, now let's end the video right at here. And um, I think you could say bye, yeah, bye, guys. And hope you enjoyed. So, tomorrow we are gonna edit some of the tools and stuff. And I can't edit the lava bucket, but you use the same trick for the water bucket to edit the lava bucket, and um. Yeah guys, so now we are going to see you in the next episode of pack making. So maybe in the next episode we are also going to collab. So bye guys.